Oh my god, the deck that counters us. Nothing to pick up when <laughs> I'm done with you. Oh dear me. Uh okay. Yeah, this deck really does counter us a hell of a lot. Um gosh, do we need our own movement cards or something? Damn. Right, well, we can get rid of that for sure. Keltullis is nice, but Oof, we have not got So that can help us get rid of the engines. So I think we want to get rid of Maxi. That's pretty nice. Right. Again. Let's go. Let's play this big guy. A random enemy unit by four. Well, what can we do to that? So he's going to deal four direct damage to that. Okay. So, let's see. What do we want to play? What do we want to play? I think we just go ahead and play the Egan here. It does get four damage onto it, but that's fine. He still needs to hit that for five somehow. Let's go. Come on. Do your worst. Man, Scoyatel is so strong, this patch, dude. <laughs> I'm not even lying to you. Scoyatel is strong. We've got to play some other stuff. Oh my days. Yeah, our opponent really wants to get rid of that. Okay. I think we Imlarith's Wrath on that. It's not a bad spend. We knew that that card is just going to be up and down, up and down all the time, so yeah. But ideally, we need to get some units down. The reason we want to get some units down is so that this can potentially miss the again. Unless our opponent's just going for it now. <laughs> okay. Okay. Well, I'm going to go play my card. <laughs> that was kind of weird. I suppose he can use it to boost his own units, but yeah, I suppose if he wants to carry over, that's not a bad play. Wow, our opponent's using all them gold cards. Some sweet, sweet golds. Yep. Okay. Okay. Let's go with... Hmm. Not too sure on this matchup, actually. Uh, Nithral is pretty useless here until our opponent uses their ability. Keltullis is going to be quite useless. I'm thinking what we want to do is... I think what I want to do is threaten the Dimeritium bomb on that. Yeah, I'm pretty happy with that. We're still ahead here as well, which is nice. We're miles ahead. Aha, okay. So our guy over here gets a boost. And to stop that, I think what we need to do is just go Red Haze there. So we're still ahead. Nicely. Oh wow, yeah. Our opponent is going for it. 
Like, really going for it. Check that out. Okay, so... <laughs> so they play the castle. Hit that. Okay, so that's a five now. Can we do anything about that? Have we actually got enough removal to do anything about anything? I actually don't think that we have. Uh, let's see. Do we want to remove anything from the bin? That goes back and that hits us. He just goes up by one. So, our opponent has to play a card. So, you know what? I'm happy for them to take this. So, we go up by one. Our opponent has to play a card. And it doesn't really matter. We've got a ton of card advantage in hand right now. So we're not too worried at the moment. <laughs> in theory. What do you guys reckon, man? Are we going to get some Valheim going a bit later on? What do you think? Alright. Three cards from our opponent. Let's go. Just three in hand. We've got a shed load. We're good here. Because we play one card. Yeah, we play one. Osril's there. Nice. Okay, that's pretty nice to have, that's pretty decent to have. Okay. Opponent definitely passes here, which is why we kept the squirrel. And what are we going to eat? Probably that, because our opponent can play it again. And we have a full hand of cards. And our opponent only has nine. So not only do we get to play first, we also get to uh, yeah have the last say. And Cave Troll is a lifesaver. Nice. And if we hide the cards, I think we've pretty much got everything that we would want. Owner Romancy would be nice to just grab the beast or anything else flexible. But you know what? I'm actually really happy with this hand. It's pretty crazy. Uh... Packed. I can get rid of an engine, but we've also got removal beast. Beautiful, look at that. So what's going to happen is my opponent's going to... I've got the cave troll there. What my opponent's going to do is move that to the bottom. When they move it to the bottom, I'm going to put Siri Dash there. And what that's going to allow us to do is draw that extra card that we need. Or not that we need even, that we want. And then our opponent can just do whatever the heck they like. Defender. Okay. Would you know I crushed your leaf or rip it clean off? So we're going to go ahead and play Siri. And we'll give Siri a boost. And. Let's see, it's just lock or purify. So purify can get rid of the veil. If our opponent has purify anyway, that's fine. So we'll do that. So our opponent really needs very specific removal here. Okay. Just one more feather and we'll get you. So... I'm going to go ahead and play Nithral. And I'm going to put that on him. Just to make it hard for our opponent to kill it. Because if they ever do remove the cave troll down, at least we've got some stuff that we can do. Yeah, this is an interesting match. We're having to sort of give in to the fact that our opponent's got their engines out. Look at that. Yeah, I figured that was going to happen. Yep, kind of figured that was going to happen. So, let's see. 
So what we're going to do is we're going to hit that. I'm probably just going to play the beast down. And just let it just grow. And then next turn with Nithral, we should be able to do that. Now, if our opponent removes Nithral from the front, what we can do is play Keltullis and we're in a really good spot. All this is purely theoretical. And we could even purify it, to be fair, but you know what? We can just kill it off. That's fine. can do that. And that. Now we draw a card as well, which is nice. Probably not the best card to draw, but okay. But we do need to start removing stuff. So how are we going to do that? Okay. So our opponent's going to give that a boost. And let's see, what else are we going to do? More than likely, so that Dryad Matron is causing us some, uh, some issues. Our opponent knows we've got Keltolis. That is currently a 3, so we'll make that a 6. And we're going to go ahead and play the Hound so that that can continue to grow as well. Our Beast is a little bit stagnant at the moment, but that's okay. We'll, we'll figure that out. We can play Osril. Yeah, Osril on the back row. Yeah. And then that'll start growing again. But thankfully, we're a card up from our opponent, so we'll still be able to get some sort of value off Kiltolis, regardless. Maybe we should have played the uh, Taskmaster on his defender. Maybe we should have done that. In fact, I'm pretty certain we should have done that. <laughs> Although, in saying that, in saying that, that isn't too bad of a thing for us right now because we can just go this one like is that. Fetch me another. And we can, let's see, it's the symbiosis cards that are going to be a pain in the ass. Doomed, there's only one, two symbiosis. So yeah, let's start getting rid of the symbiosis cards. Ah, oh, okay, so yeah, we didn't have um, dominance either. That's interesting. Our opponent's keeping us at bay there. Destroy the right most. Wow. <laughs> Damn, okay. So at this point, we're going to go Osril. That's a nice little boost for us. We're also at plus, so we can get rid of that. What am I doing? It's not even a symbiosis card. Yeah, I should have been getting rid of the other symbiosis cards, but we're okay, I think. We've got some decent removal. Five damage to... M. Okay. So we can do that. We'll just throw Maxi down for the hell of it. Why not? And the card that we don't want is that. There you go. This has got to be Gord, right? Perfect. Okay, Gazarus. To play with my I enjoy 
We know that goes down, that's fine. And play that. And then what do we get rid of? So if we get rid of 11, we then get rid of the 2. I think that should be enough. Wait a second. I'm going to do the maths here. So if we get rid of the 8, he doesn't get the boost on everything else. So that's 8, 9, 10. So 10 is 10 enough for us. Yes, 10 is enough for us. Lovely. <laughs> we had to do some maths there. That was not a strong point, but there we go. We had to get some maths going. Let's go. <laughs> You know it's bad when I have to actually start counting. Like, really bad.